Hey Caldwell, uh, are you hearing the song that keeps playing on repeat in my mind? Yeah, um, everyone's hearing that. That's it, Your brain is one of the top channels on the Satan satellite network down here. It just sounds like styrofoam being rubbed together. Ooh, yeah. Uh, and then just a real, real fresh dance beat underneath. All rise, be alarmed, be ready for the great cartooning that is about to befall ye. Uh, hey Managar. Hey, hey, Managar. How's it going? Uh, not too good. My bosses have kind of caught wind of the fact that uh, you've just constantly been producing failures. Yeah. That's that's what we do. This is next one. No more half-assing. No more lollygagging. And God forbid, if, if we even dilly-dally for a second, it's going to be our testicles on the hammer stone. Oh. Oh, man. Oh, no. Yeah. I hate that's my least favorite stone. This week's topic is from a, a, a really great demon. He just goes by a taco, and he says... Draw a cyborg music band, Ooh. you know, with instruments as body parts. Oh, that's fun. Yeah, I like that. Yeah, we, we won't do any lollygagging on that. No, no, no. I, I want to get right to work. There is a catch. Uh, because the pressure is on, they've brought in some extra oversight for mm. this project. Oh. You're, you're about to deal with the best of the best. She's my personal supervisor. Mm. All right, let me get her in on this uh, on this hell call. Uh, Eggman, is that you? Yes. Are you, are you are you are you seeing? Yes, I see. I see. Hi, Managar. Hi. How are you? I'm averting my eyes. Good. Happy to hear that. Hi, little boys. How are you? Nathan Caldwell. Hi, Eggman. Hi, Eggman. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Oh, you have a nice little office set up. Yeah, it's very warm. Mm -hmm. It's very warm in here. Yeah. But we don't sweat. I wish I could, but it just stays inside and kind of like rolls around in my stomach. Yes. It's kind of, you know, what you deserve. So that's good. Mm -hmm. That's good. Just don't mind me today. I'm just... Here to observe, I'm a little fly humanoid on the wall, you know? Mm, sure. So you do everything as normal. Okay, great. Well, I'm gonna go ahead and get us started here, Nathan. I feel like I've got a great idea. Yeah, we, we better get into it. My thought is, I, I, I wanna take it, like take a real literal approach here. Cyborg music band where their uh, appendages are instruments? Yes. I'll just go ahead and draw like an actual cyborg. Sure. Just like real true to the definition, kind of humanoid. Because, uh, you know, there's a difference between an android and a cyborg, I believe. Right. Right. Mm -hmm. The cyborg has some uh, biological components, mm -hmm. which I think I think you need to get the um, the real uh, emotional resonance of music. Exactly. I, I don't want music created by an algorithm. Uh, hey, boys. Yes. I, I hate to interrupt. I'm noticing okay. the way you're drawing this, this cyborg. Yeah. Does he need to be so sort of gaunt looking? I wonder if we could beef him up. Beef him up, like you want him uh, thicker or more muscular? I, or what, what are you thinking? I'm thinking thick. I'm thinking wide. I'm thinking wide. huge. I think that's just 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 sort of what sells nowadays. You know what I mean? Does you, that? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Just just stretch him out. Mm -hmm. Let me just stretch him out a bit. Yeah. There we go. From there. How's that feeling? Yeah. I'm wondering. Just for giggles, uh -huh. does, does he go yeah. wider? Does it go wider? <laughs> we can try. It's. I don't. I mean, the canvas. I'm gonna run out of canvas. It, at a certain point. I like the idea of a leading musician who is as wide as the stage they perform on. Oh, that's true. He's like yeah. the stage, maybe he's the stage himself. I mean, like, <laughs> he's got a presence to be sure. That's, yeah. I mean, this kind of works in with what I was actually planning. So honestly, Agman, you, you've, only, you've only helped me. Mm -hmm. I'm just gonna keep him as wide as possible. But what I am thinking I wanna do here is just, uh, just give him a keyboard, kind of like popping out right here. Oh, keyboard belly. Yeah, keyboard belly. I mean, this is like a Korg. It's like a cyborg, I guess is how you would describe him. Interesting. <laughs> so he's like half cyborg, half Korg. Now, I'm noticing the way you're sort of drawing that keyboard, it seems rather, rather thin. Now, <laughs> okay. is there any way that we could perhaps get it a little wider? Wider? Yeah. Okay. What? That seems to be kind of the flavor of the day, huh? I'm literally, I'm just thinking about our demo, you know? Young women at, mm -hmm. in hell wanting to watch something. They're going to want a little treat, you know what I mean? The sex sells. <laughs> You're going to want a snack, for sure. It's so wide it goes all the way around, yes. Oh, no, that's interesting. Like a full kind of like a circular bar, kind of like a floating island of, yeah. of keys. Yeah. That way, yeah, that way he's got keys everywhere. Mm -hmm. He never runs out of space. Exactly. Tickle the ivories. <laughs> Does he have like a 
fun catchphrase we can give him, something something that people can really latch on to. I just want to make sure we're marketing this the way that we should be, you know? I'm open to anything. Mm -hmm. uh, Nathan, you want to help me brainstorm maybe some catchphrases for this fun fellow? That's the key's knees. Interesting. <laughs> you know, um, uh, maybe like, I'm tickled by that. I'm tickled by that is, is pretty good. Mm-hmm. I, I do want to just kind of shove as many keys in here as I can. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm, I'm just going to put some in like the, do like a little mouth thing right there. He's got like kind of like a um, like an Islander vibe a little bit. Yeah. Like uh, I, this feels like a grass skirt almost to me. Oh. Oh. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's good. Now, Cobble, I hate to interrupt. I'm okay. sort of noticing these legs. They're kind of little chicken legs. Is there any <laughs> way that we could go wider? I mean, I'll I'll see what I can do, Agman. I'm really, we're really stretching the the boundaries of reality of what what's possible with with art. But um, you want some tree trunks? I'll I'll give you tree trunks, ma'am. I live to serve, so maybe just like, how about like that? Oh, baby! Like like wow. he's just got some big jinkos on. If somebody were wearing some big jinkos, but then they took off their jinkos and it was just all flesh under there. Oh, it's like a hideous tree trunk yeah. of flesh. Kind of like that? Yeah, that's speaking to me. I want this to sort of be like our magic mic, you know? I'm feeling very aroused looking at those legs. This is just like... <laughs> this is like Baymax's shitty brother. Baymax's sexy brother, you mean. <laughs> is there any way we can slap a, a little Yamaha on that keyboard? Maybe double this as some sort of branding exercise? Yeah, maybe it's like right, just like right here? Yeah. Since he is such a fucking snack, uh, I'm going to make it say Yamaha. Oh, terrific. Uh, just like right there, just slap that on. Yeah. Is that his name? Can that be his name? I think Yamaha is definitely this big tubby piano boy's name for sure. Yeah. I just have one last thing I need to do, which oh, is just wow. give him just these little like, yeah, yeah. Just, just a little, little flourish, wow. just a little flair. Yamaha is ready for the stage floor. Um, Nathan, would you please draw your cyborg band member? Hey. Nathan, you know what my favorite part about hell is? What? All the cursing you can do. Oh, Unfortunately, yeah. every time I curse on YouTube, a tiny little buzzard comes and just like pecks my butt. Oh, the curse buzzard. Yeah, 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 yeah. Every time I say a f or a sh or a f he comes and he gives me a little peck and I hate it, so. I hate to break it to you guys, but we're gonna have to cut off the episode, so if you wanna watch the rest of it, you're gonna have to sign up for Dropout. <laughs> Ow, yep. oh, yep. Tip him a dick, you got me. Great work, everyone. But uh, shouldn't we get back to the show? Yeah!